Hey, thanks for letting me ride on the bus with you. Hey, you want to have some locker room talk? I moved on her, actually. Whoa, whoa, whoa. That's not locker room talk. I, I meant, like, good play, good pass, like that kind of thing. I moved on her, and I failed. I'll admit it. Well, as long as you didn't try to her and she was single. I did try and her. She was married. <laughs> oh, you're awesome. Hey, you ever thought of being president? And I moved on her very heavily. In fact, I took her out furniture shopping. Ah, uh, sweet move. Was it Levitt's? She wanted to get some furniture. I said, I'll show you where they have some nice furniture. <laughs> Levitt's. But I couldn't get there, and she was married. And all of a sudden, I see her. She's now got the big phony tits and everything. She's totally changed her look. Well, it is 2005. Everything's changing. Which reminds me, I have an idea for this thing called Twitter, where crazy people can bash ladies and minorities at 3 a.m. She's your girl's hot as shit in the purple. Oh, also Uber. I, I invented it, if you're listening to this in the future. I gotta use some Tic Tacs just in case I start kissing her. That's the cheapest breath mint. I thought you were a billionaire. You know, I'm automatically attracted to beautiful. I just start kissing them. It's like a magnet. You just kiss. I don't even wait. And when you're a star, they let you do it. You can do anything. Whatever you want. What, like grab him by the hand? Grab him by the pussy. Oh, my. <laughs> I can do anything. <laughs> Down below. Pull the hell. Uh, he can't open it because of his tiny hands. <laughs>